My name is Jason Situ. I was born in southern China uh, in 1949. My daddy is a high school teacher, and my mother is a, just a housewife. I was a very good student in school. Maybe someday I will become a scientist or something. Yeah, but I never think um, I will become an artist. When I was a high school student, the Chinese have a movement called the Cultural Revolution happened. The Cultural Revolution changed all my life. All the school almost closed, no class. And of course, I spent a few years work on the rice field, yeah. About six o'clock, you have to ready to go to work, yeah. And sometimes I work to the midnight. I met a real artist there. I started to paint outdoor, and we found an art book uh, called a, a French Impressionism. That book almost became our Bible during that time. We cannot uh, reach the original masterpiece, mostly just from the book. So we just look, look at Monet, uh, Pizarro, yeah, yeah, for the step, yeah, they go outdoor to paint the London. I came here in 1989 with my family. I don't uh, think the art can can make a life uh, for me, so I uh, fire a job. 刚出来,大陆出来,你又有房租,又有租房子,又有,他也没有放弃,他就没有,他就去画画. There was a resurgence with plein air art in uh, the late 70s, early 80s. We've had a uh, fine art show for 39 consecutive years in coordination with the uh, city of San Dimas. We've never done a plein air event. The Suchi people, we met with them and talked about the event and, and talked about the history of the festival. But this was a good outreach for us and also for the Suchi people. The, the history of the campus is amazing. Initially, Jory Voorhees' home for the wayward boys. In fact, a former mayor of this town was raised on that campus. And I think they're going to be blown away by the, by the beauty of it, the area of the campus itself, the area around the campus. Well, he applied to be in our show, and I invited him out to my home. He brought with him three of his paintings for me to review. He said, uh, well, can I be in the show? I said, you're in the show. Each generation becomes more and more interested in the intense way that these artists paint. I mean, it's a very intense process, and they're working with light, they're working with color, they're working with, and it's moving, so they're trying to capture a moment. Um, it's beautiful work. You have to have uh, several elements in a successful painting. You have to have good drawing, then the artist has to be very good at a sense of three-dimensional space, which is called perspective. Then it has to have the proper color. Then it has to be attractive. It has to be something that's beautiful. So there were several paintings that, that met all those qualifications, and it was very close between four paintings. But in the end, I had to choose one. I was asked to pick out the best in show, which is, you know, a very dangerous job, but, um, I did my judging, it was very difficult, and the winner of the Best in Show is a painting entitled Morning at Su Chi by Jason C2. His was the biggest painting. That means that he paints very quickly. And if he can paint quickly, that means he's good. The people maybe just come, oh, just one hour, two hour, you earn so many money, so look at that. Not only two hours of painting, painting. It should be 40 years and two hours finish this painting. Without the 40 years of hard work, can, maybe you cannot make it. His work is outstanding, and um, we certainly will have him back next year as well.
For myself, I'm really enjoy my life just like this. Do all the things I like and, and still can make a living. I feel I'm really lucky. Yeah.